Hello, I'm Roger Bisbee from Skill Builder, and today I'm out doing a bit of drill testing. I'm actually testing this drill bit, which is an MX4 SDS Plus drill bit from Milwaukee. And I'm gonna see just how many holes I can get out of this single drill bit into this very dense concrete. This is a curb stone, pretty standard stuff. You'll know just how dense that is, it's like a pad stone. So this is a drill you might use for fixings. So I'm gonna give it a go. Now, the interesting thing about it is that, as I call it a quad drill, MX4, which means that it's got four tips on it. And that means that when you're drilling with it, it centers very nicely on the hole. So you may know that sometimes with SDS drills, you get a slightly elliptical hole when you're doing fixings, that's not great. So this makes a rounder hole, it centers it so that it just remains true where you're drilling. But also importantly, if it hits a bit of rebar, rather than chipping one of the tongues and tips off and diverting it across from the rebar, it just carries on straight through and it will go through the rebar. So a very, very good drill bit to have Okay, so, so far I've done 18 times five. I've done uh, five, eight, 40, I've done 90 holes here so far. So I wouldn't say that was completely dead, that drill bit. If I was drilling through brickwork and things like that, I'd carry on using it. But obviously through this dense concrete, it's starting to take too long to do it. And you can see that a fair amount of heat is built up just at the top here because I've been just pumping this drill bit in non-stop. I mean, whoever does that, drills that many holes in dense concrete. Normally you drill a couple of holes, put your fixings in, drill a couple more, and that's the way you tend to work. So this is an extreme test for this drill bit, and I think it's done pretty well. They reckon that you'll get four times the battery life if you're using a cordless tool, which is obviously a tremendous help because that means you're not running back to the charger so often. I mean, a lot of people, they, they worry about power tools an awful lot and about batteries and so on, but they don't think about the accessories. They don't think about the drill bit. So they're going for big, high capacity batteries, but they're not matching it with the best drill bit they can get. So what I was impressed with, by the way, is the way that it cleared the debris out, that it cleared the hole. And that, that fluting is really effective at that. Normally, when I'm drilling down into something like concrete, I've got to pull the drill bit out to clear the dust out and then go back in to stop it jamming. But with this, it seemed to just carry on. So yeah, jamming isn't a problem. You can see I haven't even got a side handle on this drill at the moment. I was using it single-handed on 12 mil and it didn't snag once. So that's pretty good. I'm pretty impressed with it. And uh, it's a nice little test to do just to give it a go. And the four tips means that you can go through rebar without any trouble at all. I'm Roger Pisby, I hope you found that interesting and we'll be back with more tests soon.